What's going on guys? We're back for another quick video and this video is how to make a book cover for your KDP business and the interior all in under five minutes and we're going to be doing this with the help of Book Bolt, which is an amazing tool that I highly recommend you guys all check out. But before we get into this, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel for daily, weekly and monthly updates on e-commerce, print on demand and KDP. And of course, check the description below for any of the tools that I mentioned or any other relevant uh, resources that I talk about in my videos. So let's go ahead and get right into this. Here we are in the Book Bolt backend dashboard. And you guys can see they have a bunch of modules over here. They're adding to this every month. But where we're going to go is over here on the right side. Now, there's a bunch of kind of additional, I don't want to call them hidden modules over here, but other kind of very valuable resources, the Book Bolt Mass Converter, which I use to move all my merch designs over, the Book Bolt Designer, which we're going to dig into here, Book Bolt Lister, and the Auto Uploader and KDP Spy. Now, today we're going to take a look at the Book Bolt Designer. We're going to open this up really quick. And this is going to allow us to create our cover very, very quickly. It helps if you already have a design that you're going to put on there. Um, that's what we're going to be doing for this example. If you don't, they do have some free uh, items in there, but you could like clip art, etc. But you can also go ahead and get, you know, some basics done on Canva, download those and pull them in here and upload them. So um, you'll see here where you're prompted to choose between a cover or interior. We're going to start with the cover. We put in our trim size, six by nine is what I've been doing for all of my journals and 120 pages for our page count. Um, and what this is going to do, it's going to take a minute here, but it's going to generate that template. And this is the same template that we would get if we were to go over to KDP's website here. And I'll put a link to this also in the description. Um, and you know, put in the same parameters, six by nine inch, 120 pages, white page color. If we download this, it's going to be the same template size. Bookbull just does it all for us. So you guys can see it takes a minute to generate this. When it pulls in here, it's going to have this kind of clean back or black color background. We can change this to any color we want. Um, for most of my things right now, I have been keeping it just as that. And let's go ahead. We're going to use our classic example here, the cornhole theme. And we're going to go ahead and pull this over here size it up and I don't get too crazy about making sure it's perfect on here. The biggest thing is you guys want to leave room on the sides because when Amazon prints these out, it's not always perfectly aligned. So they do have that bleed area. Um, I've ordered a few journals now for myself just to kind of check out the quality. And that is one thing that I will uh, tell you guys is that you always want to make sure you leave some space on the sides so that your product, it looks good. It's on the cover and it's not cut off. We don't want any of this stuff cut off on the side here. Um, Amazon's cranking these out, so they're doing them very quick. Now, um, that's really it for this. So this cover is done, but before we actually download it, I just want to show you guys, um, we can actually go and find clip art in here. Um, let's see if we just search star, let's see what it finds. So it is not cooperating with me right now, but there, normally this will populate with a bunch of clip art that's already in the system. You can go in here and easily add, you know, your own text. Um, hello, composition notebook. And this is really helpful too, if you guys just have like a really cool image and you just, or like a design and you just wanna add some text to the top so that you can put it in your title. Um, this is one of the things that I do is, you know, I'll just pull, pull it in here quickly add some kind of nice looking text hello composition notebook you know and there we have it we have something we can actually include in our title because remember the title has to match exactly what it says on the cover it can't have any additional words you have to save those for the subtitle so we want to make sure that anything we want to include in our main title we actually have here on the design on this cover so um that's really it guys there's some other stuff uh, things in here you can upload your own images that's where i uploaded this design these were just some random ones i was playing around with we have these basic shapes in here that we can use so uh, we can pull these in if we wanted to kind of accentuate this and we can even freehand draw i never do this just because my drawing skills are pretty subpar but it's in there um we can add different layers in here and then we can even add effects so we can actually distress this Let's go ahead and see what that one looks like. So you guys can see it's distressing a little bit. If you guys are familiar with Merch and Merch Informer, then you've already been using this very similar dashboard here. 
Um, the final one is we can create masks and that what a mask is, is it is just like this example of the text with kind of an image that's been wrapped over the top of the text. So for this, we already have our design, we pulled it in and that's how easy it is. All we have to do now is we literally just go ahead and download this. It's gonna take a second, pop up a new window and then we're able to download this cover. Let's just show you guys that. So it's gonna pop up here and we just hit download and that's our cover, done. So that took what, all but all of two minutes. Uh, obviously if we don't have a design, it's gonna take a little bit longer. We're gonna have to custom make the design, but that's just a really quick way to actually get your covers done uh, very easily. Book Bolt's pretty cheap. I wanna say it's 10 bucks to start uh, and it, I think it goes up from there. So um, let's go ahead and check out the interiors. So we can click this interior tab and you guys will see, this is how easy it is to get your interior. So again, for all of mine, I'm doing bleed. Uh, we're gonna do six by nine, and we're gonna put in our 120 pages and hit download. Um, and actually, I'm not sure which one it's gonna download. So this is just, I guess, a blank, blank pages. Um, but you guys can see here, we have all these different options. We have blank, we have college rules, we have a journal music sheets wide world a recipe book we have scuba diving journal it's a very unique one uh this hexagon paper fishing comic book some graph paper guitar tabs and you guys can see you know they're always adding stuff in here which is cool so that's a nice thing with book bolt is that it does get more and more valuable uh because they're always adding new modules in here and they're adding new interiors so this is really nice i mean if you guys think about it this way if you have one design for a cover you literally could make a different journal listing for every single thing that's in here, blank, college ruled. So now your one cover turns into what, 30 plus different designs that you can list on the KDP platform. And the nice thing is we're, you know, batching these. So it's all with the same keywords or very similar keywords and title. And it makes it really, really simple for you guys to get all the pieces in order without doing a lot of work, you know, in Photoshop or Illustrator um, or anything else. So. Once we choose, let's just go ahead and choose the college rules and we hit download and it is gonna give us the downloaded uh, or download version of this template. Hit download here and that is it guys. So that is it for this video. Now we would be able to take these right over to the KDP backend and upload these directly into the system. Everything's gonna be formatted and sized properly for us and that is how simple it is to actually get your cover and interiors done. Uh, now, I will mention one other tool that I actually use quite a bit for my interiors, and that is Tangent Templates. Uh, I like Tangent Templates. If you guys don't want to pay a monthly you know, fee for BookBolt, I, I have no affiliation with Tangent Templates other than that I bought their product, and they just have a bunch of different interiors as well. I think it's a one-time fee of 59 bucks. There you go. So it's $59, and then you get access to all of the different templates that they have in there. Um, they have a lot of similar ones, the college rule paper. You guys can kind of see a few of them here. Uh, some drawing, music sheets, etc. So I hope that video was helpful. I know that was very, very simple and basic stuff, but it always helps to kind of go over the basics and make sure that everyone's on the same page. So let me know down below in the comments what you guys are using for your KDP cover creation and interiors. I know there's lots of other tools out there, so let me know what some of your favorites are. And of course, hit the like button if you got some value out of this and subscribe to the channel to get you know, the continual updates as we get better and better on the KDP platform. And of course, check the description for any tools that I mentioned today. But with that, guys, we will see you at the next video. Cheers.